Hi guys, it's me. Hi, my name is me. Hi, welcome to the next lesson to Sage 15 account lesson training. Today, we will see how to record our sales invoices and our purchase invoices. Let's start with the sales invoices. In order to register your sales invoices, you go to customer. You click on invoice and then you register. Let's say our customer were you type your customer account number. Let's say it's one three two. What's this blue start? You because you previously we register the customer. So when you register the customer and you want to do the invoice by typing the account number of the customer that you already registered straight away you're gonna have the customer name and all that and let's say the reference is one two three and the customer we sell to this customer shoes and previously we recorded shoes at forty four thousand and we come here to details and we type sell shoes and because it's reselling it's an activity it's taxable now previously we saw because capital wasn't taxable we used t9 because selling is in a business that a trading activity is taxable that now we use t1 let's say the amount net of the shoes that we sold was 900 pounds and that is the vat the vat and the next customer let's say it was two is prints okay and then the reference is one two four and we sold to this customer equipment and the equipment was rigid was we we sell equipment that was two four thousand one and we come here we type sales equipment okay and then let's say that was 1005 you go to rate you got it the next one let's say uh we pay um let's say our customer to the next one let's say you know we saw table you just do it like this and then when you finish you save it you just record it this is your invoice you just keep recording 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 and after that you save it then you save it and you close now for the suppliers purchase invoice you click suppliers you come to invoice and you type the suppliers account number let's say b you see because we already registered previous slide straight away you have it as i said for every purchase is all the nominal code is always five thousand and five thousand was recorded i purchase equipment purchase equipment and let's say that was five hundred pounds five thousand pounds and is it taxable because it's a trading activity and the second one let's say that was d for domestic appliances and then uh, but we pay rent to this person we pay rent to them okay and rent is not taxable but it's exempt from tax it's exempt from tax okay and because it's exempt from tax here is purchase because it's exempt from tax you come here let's say that was 300 300 and then because it's exempt from tax you say you select t9 you select t9 and you click ok you say it's not taxable then you can save so in the next lesson i will show you how to record a credit note a credit note is every item that has been damaged or has been returned from your supplier or from your customer or your room planet. See you in the